Hi everybody, Angela's here. I'm in the living room. I'm in the living room, excuse me, I burped. I'm in the living room, on the sitting on the floor. There's Harley right there sleeping on the blankie. Some flowers there on the table in her cage. She was speaking. I was watching the video that my mom posted and my birdie heard my sister's birds and she just started going dee, dee. so it was really cute. Um, this is for my mom that I'm doing this video right now. I posted a couple, maybe two videos earlier, but this is for my mom. We, we will come get you, Mom. My man would get off around 3 or 4. He's working really hard right now. The boss man is there, and being a J-E-R-K won't let my man leave early. And he he's going to come get you, don't worry. And we will get bag ice for you. And I got cups here if you want to bring your own cup and whatever. It's fine. Um, try to get the milk for my sister because I have not went to the store to get your milk. Or when you come here, I'll just go and pick up your milk at the store for you to have here. Nothing to worry about. No big deal at all. We will come get you. Just please relax. Don't be rushing. Have your rest. And um, that's all I can say. I like your nightgown, Mama. It's pretty. Or your dress or whatever you had on. I like it. It's pretty. It looks good on you. Matches your nails. And I am ready. Ready to see you. And I know you're going to help us with the, the, the little car because our truck right now having problems. Got to fix it. We won't keep Betsy for long if we keep having problems. We'll have to put up for her and get for sale. But that's no big deal. Not right now. Um, but thank you for helping us with the car. That means a lot. I know you're going to help us. And we're going to help you. And for a thank you treat, we'll take you to the store to get whatever you need. And we want to take you out to dinner, me and my husband, as a thank you and everything. That's his treat. Not for me. That's from your son-in-law because he loves you. And he appreciate what you do and everything. And I will do your hair and cut it and color it. It's no big deal. I won't mind. And I've been cleaning, getting stuff ready, and just that's it. I just gotta do my room. Then I'm done. I got a blanket over there on the I got a blanket over there for my mother to do whatever she wants with. And I have that black chair over there that's cotton and comfy for Chanel to sleep in or for my mom to put her feet up and relax. It's no big deal. There's this cover on the sofa with the other blankets there. Um... My mom knows about my apartment. It's not very big, nothing fancy, but I try to do it. I like to have my place clean and nice for so when I have company or just my mom come over. I like her to be happy, relaxed, and enjoy herself. And she has the TV to watch. It's right up there. Right up there. And she can do whatever she wants. There's tables to put her stuff on. The shelf she can put her stuff in. So nothing happens. Um, we'll go and get stuff for her if she needs anything. It's not a big deal. We don't mind. She's only here for two days. But it's alright. We want to take care of her too. And everything. And your son-in-law loves you. He said he loved you. And kept asking me if I talked to you today and I said no because I told him you were relaxing and I've been cleaning so everything's been okay today uh, it's a, a nice day out today not too cold not too hot but whatever hopefully we get the cold front soon I'm hoping supposed to um Mother, thank you for the Bible. I commented on the video that you posted. Thank you. I will read it. 
It would go on my nightstand in my room next to my bed where I sleep and I'll read it every night or every morning. So it helps me too because I don't have a Bible. And the beauty thing that I'm talking about mom is nothing for you to worry about. I don't want anything from you. Um, I don't want anything from anybody at any ways. Um, it's just a beauty, you know, makeup, lotion, body spray, just stuff like that. But I'm not asking for anything from nobody or from my mother. I respect everybody. I respect everyone. And I love everyone. And I also love the police and the firefighters and ambulance and paramedics and army and everyone everywhere. I also respect and love them. I always wanted to be a police officer since I was a little girl. Um, I still want to be, but that's just too much freaking hard work to do, and I could never do it because of my issues and anxiety and panic attacks and stressing and all this crap that I hate. I take medicine for mine, and it helps me relax, helps me fall asleep, and that's all that matters. And everything, and yep, I'm happy to see my mom today. And I know, I hope she's happy to come see us, and she can relax. And she don't have to worry about nothing, and we'll get whatever she wants to eat tonight. We'll give to her and make her happy and stuff. Nothing to worry about because she's helping us big time with our car. So I respect that, and I love her. And, um, yeah, that's pretty much it. I can't wait to see you, Mom. I love you, and I'm happy you're coming, and we'll be there to get you if we don't get lost because we don't know where you, my sister lives exactly. And we'll use GPS and hope we find it. We will with GPS. It's fine. And I'll see you soon, Mom. I love you. Relax. Love you, Chanel Nail. And love you, Mama. Bye. Mwah.